Now, the government has announced that it's to ban referral fees in personal injury cases. It says the current system in which personal injury details are sold on by insurance companies to lawyers encourages the compensation culture and leads to higher car insurance premiums. New figures show there continues to be wide variations in the way police forces in England and Wales record allegations of rape. Data supplied to BBC News under the Freedom of Information Act shows the proportion of allegations which end up being classed as no crime varies between 2 and 30 per cent. 16 minutes past six. You're watching Breakfast from BBC News. The main stories this morning. Still to come on Breakfast this morning. It's described. Yikes. Yikes. <laughs> uh, with... A large turnout is expected today at the funeral of Mark Duggan, who was shot by... New figures show there continue to be wide variations in the way that police forces in England and Wales treat allegations of rape. President Obama has announced a job creation programme in the United States worth almost £300 billion. In a rare address, to... the government has announced it's to ban referral fees in personal injury cases. It says the current system in which personal injury details are sold on by insurance companies to lawyers encourages the compensation culture and leads to higher car insurance premiums. Um, coming up, BBC News Channel has the... Breakfast actress Anita Dobson, impressionist boy. Time now, though, to get the news where you are. See you in a moment. You need to analyse whether it does what it does well. Is out now. Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, let's have a look at the weather now. Matt's there for us today. The live coverage of the last night of the proms on Saturday on BBC Two from 7.30 before it switches to BBC One at 10 past nine for the second part. And you can also listen live on BBC Radio Three and online. Enjoy. Uh, on Wednesday, we brought you the news of the 14 celebrities who will be taken to the dance floor for this year's Strictly Come Dancing. Two of those aspiring Twinkle Toes are Anita Dobson and Rory Bremner, and they're going to be with us in just a moment. At first, here's Cara Toynton and her partner, Artem, dancing in last year's final. The old magic is out on Monday. And that's all from breakfast for this morning. Thanks for your company this morning. Back at six tomorrow.